So in this video, I'm gonna show you how to do the 90 degree back. Usually you wouldn't be in the yellow, see? Usually you'll be out here because trucks will be here. But for the sake of showing you guys how to do the 90 and there not being many people here, I'm gonna do it like this just so I don't block the traffic on this side if you're coming in like that. So, I'll show you. Hopefully you can see this well because I'm using the back camera so I don't know what you can and can't see. Take your time 
and just like that now i'm kind of straight and now all i do is a straight back well from the looks of this is a pretty big uh make sure your wheel is straight if your wheel is straight now you do the corrective turns that they teach you in school but this is a big parking spot so usually it wouldn't be this big sometimes it's very tight sometimes you'll have trucks on both sides of it and just like that that's how you do a 90 degree back and however period of time it took me to do it but again there's no rush and of course when there's other tractors and trailers around other trucks you want to get out and look as much as uh as much as needed but since there's no trucks around me and i drive with my shoes off so give me a second but since there's no trucks around me i didn't have to get out and look but you want to always get out and look but you're going to get a feel for it uh in general but that's the basic way that's the basic uh ways of doing it basic uh oh five minutes That's the basic techniques, I guess. I don't know what I'm trying to say, but yeah. I hope this second camera conveyed it all well. And I guess I could talk by them both to try to sync them. Uh, it wouldn't matter, but yeah. I think I think I got it on camera pretty well. Peace. Oh, I just showed you guys how to do a 90 degree backup. Uh, if you could do the 90, you could do the uh, 45 because when I came from the 90, by the time I got about here, that was the 45. And the straight back, they're going to teach you that in school. Uh, but, you know, if you need some tips on it, if you didn't go to KLLM, I don't know how they train in other schools, I can give you some tips. Um, if you're having trouble remembering how to fix your trailer when doing the straight back. Um, but I hope you learned something from this video. Uh, eventually, I will have better equipment. Uh, more camera so I can have a camera looking at the mirror so I can show you what I'm seeing I can have a camera looking out the side of the truck so you can see what I'm looking at when I stick my head out and a camera that's facing the wheel maybe like a, a helmet camera or a head strap camera so you can actually see me turning the wheel as I'm doing each step and um, maybe there's a program that can sync everything but I'm gonna have to do it all manually right now in my editing but I hope you learned something. I hope this was a good video. If you need more tips on something else, um, let me know. And then if you're curious about how to do a blind side back at KLLM, they tell us never to do a blind side backup. So I don't do it, I don't practice it. Um, so if you need help with that, I apologize. I won't be able to help you. But basically, if you even have a company that wants you to do it, it's the same thing just on the opposite side except the passenger side aka the blind side is called the blind side for a reason because you can't see anything over there so that's why you get out and look all the time even on your sight side so i highly do not recommend you do it on the blind side so hope this video helps um please leave your comments down below subscribe to the channel follow me on instagram i'm trying to post on Instagram, I'll post truck and stuff and my personal life, like shooting guns and stuff like that. So comment down below a video recommendation you want to see next, something helpful, if, or if you want to learn a little bit more about me. But for the majority of this channel, I really just want to help people. I will throw some vlogs in there and stuff like that if people want to see it uh, about trucking, about me talking about my personal life or anything really. But for the most part, I want to help people out on their trucking journey, especially for new truck drivers, because uh, I see a lot of older guys, they talk bad about trucking when it's still a great industry right now. Um, and I don't know why you want to tear people down, especially younger, the younger generation is trying to get into it at an early age. So I just want to show people that you can do it, you can make money from it. I'm 24 years old and I'm making great money from trucking, so I recommend you do it as well if you're interested. Peace.